A long list of multinational companies, mostly from the USA and Europe, are cutting ties with Russia or suspending business over the war in Ukraine. BP, Shell, Equiner are the three big oil-producing corporations that have said that they will exit Russia and cease all joint ventures there. Visa, MasterCard and PayPal Holdings, which gets about 4% of their net revenue from Russia, on March 5 said they are suspending operations there. Fitch Group and Moody's both said they are suspending operations in Russia soon after the ratings company slashed Russia's ratings to junk. World's biggest auto manufacturers General Motors, Ford Motors, Volkswagen, Toyota Motor Corp, Volvo and Daimler announced they would halt shipments to Russia or idle plants in the country. While McDonald's, Coca-Cola and Starbucks announced they would temporarily halt operations in Russia, Pepsi said it would suspend soft drink sales in the country. Levi Strauss, which gets about 2% of its sales from Russia and Samsung Electronics with more than 30% of the market, have suspended exports of their products. Spanish fashion retailer Inditex SA, which has 502 stores in Russia, including 86 Zara outlets, is also temporarily closing all its shops there and halting online sales. U.S. companies Amazon, Google, Microsoft, Apple, HP, Nike are suspending all new sales of their products and services in Russia. Netflix, Hollywood Studios Walt Disney, Paramount Pictures, Sony, Warner Media and Universal Pictures have halted or postponed the release of movies in Russia. Law and accounting firms Cleary Gottlieb Steen and Hamilton, Baker McKenzie, Linklater's, McKinsey, A., PricewaterhouseCoopers, KPMG and Deloitte all said they are pulling out of Russia. Most of these boycotts came after Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky called on the companies to halt all business in Russia during a video call with U.S. lawmakers. Many experts have opined that the U.S. is using its companies and those of its allies to wage an economic warfare against Russia as it has done to many smaller countries earlier.